no YouTube. I want to play a game. Stay tuned for further information. Thank you. Welcome everybody to a brand new Vegas Pro 16 tutorial. In this Vegas Pro 16 tutorial, I'll show you guys how to create a jigsaw TV look effect in Vegas Pro 16. So without further ado, let's get started. What you gotta do is open up Vegas Pro 16. If you do not have Vegas Pro 16, use the thumbnail in the top left hand corner or use the link in the description. So once you have Vegas Pro 16 up and running, what you gotta do is go to the link in the description and download the Vegas Pro 16 tutorial project file, Jigsaw, which will have the image and the green screen footage that we'll be using to create this effect. Also, I have some audio from using Audacity to create, make my voice sound like Jigsaw. So let's get started. And what you gotta do is first drag, drag and drop the picture into Vegas Pro 16. Then what you gotta do is player hamburger button, click it, edit visual button set, and click show all, and click OK. Now we're gonna right click the video track, and start a new video track. This is where the green screen TV footage will come in. So go back to our project file, drag and drop the vintage TV green screen footage. What we're gonna do is, we're gonna press S on our keyboard. Click on the first one where we just cut it, delete it, drag, drag across the footage, and we're going to press U on our keyboard to split the video and the audio, just delete it, and delete the audio track, because we ain't going to be naming it. So, we're going to right click the image, scroll down to properties, disable resample, keep main, maintain aspect ratio checked, put the green screen, right click, Go to properties, disable resample, uncheck maintain aspect ratio, click OK. The preview screen to preview and auto to get rid of the lag. Then what we're going to do is go to video effects and go to chroma keyer and select default one. Just drag and drop on top of the green screen footage. It might take a few a couple minutes to open up the effects panel, but it will close just to open it up. Go over here to the right hand corner where it says between the event parent crap, 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 crap, and more. Just hit the that button. It will open up the chroma keyer effects settings. Click on the color. Select the color picker. And just click on the green screen. And it will get rid of the green screen. So X out of there. Now we're going to do event pond, event pond a crop on the jigsaw image. Click click event pond a crop. Make sure scale of uh, center is checked. Like aspect ratio. And we're just going to drag this dude out to make sure we're not seeing anything touching the borders of the TV. That should be good. And we save this preset to jigsaw. Save it. Exit out. Now, it's time to get some fun with it. Now we're going to add a video effect. Add a TV simulator effect on it. So, within still in video effects, scroll down to you always see TV simulator. It's right here. TV simulator. Just drag and drop on the TV look onto the picture. Now, copy my settings, the detail zoom, set, keep it at 1, the aperture gill, we're going to change this to 0 0.5160, and hit enter on the keyboard. Uh, we're going to fix this as soon as we get this. The interlacing, we're going to set this to 0 0.5. The line sync and vertical sync stay on 1. The scan phasing and the static, I'm going to change it to 0 0.2440. And we're going to say this as jig saw TV effect. And I'm going to say this preset. All right now, save this. I might have to update the plugin. There it is, it's saved right there. 
now we're gonna fix this. So see we're we'll go back to vent upon the crop. Um let's try this one out check on check maintain aspect ratio. On the high threshold, I'm gonna bring this. There we go. Save it. Now we're gonna go back to the vampire crop, and there we go. Fix it down there. That's what we should have. Now we're gonna go to our video effects. Still in video effects, we're gonna go to scroll up to see. Um, we're gonna use a glow. We're gonna drag in the red glow, and we're gonna change the color to green. To a green. The glow percent all the way up. The intensity all the way up. Suppression. Hmm. Let's see what happens on the default. Might have to get a work around. Oh, shit. I'm gonna pause and come right back. Alright, we need to go back to video effects for the scan phasing. We're gonna set this to zero. And we're gonna resave this again. So, in video effects, glow, red glow, drag it on. We're going to change this to a green, suppression to zero, the intensity to 0 0.680, glow percent to zero. We're going to name this one Jigsaw TV Effect. I'm going to save it as a Jigsaw TV Effect. Oh, whoops. Jigsaw TV color effect. There we go. That should save in the plugins. Then what we're gonna do is insert an audio, not a video track, audio track. I'm gonna drag and drop, go to insert, and select audio track. I'm gonna drag an audio clip that I recorded in Audacity, and I'll be right back. Alright, so I'm going to drag and drag a WAV WAV file into Vegas Pro. Now I'm going to drag this out of here. Drag the photo to match the audio length. So I'm going to split the green screen clip, delete the rest. And I'm going to highlight everything. And that's what it should look like as I'm playing it back. There you go. And then simply how to create a jigsaw TV effect in Vegas Pro 16. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to slap a like on this video. If you're new here, please subscribe with the notifications. If you'd like to request any tutorials in Vegas Pro 16, Premiere Pro CC, Photoshop, UGD, Unreal Engine 4, or any other software, let me know in the comments below. I'll try to do this my best as to do them. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure to share the video. I'll see you guys in the next tutorial.